With construction underway, the Kanawha Charleston Humane Association has a lot going on. And today, a power outage added to some of their stress, especially since it is so hot out there. News Channel 3's Addie Smith went to check out what they did to help keep the animals cool. <laughs> On Mondays, the Kanawha Charleston Humane Association is closed to the public. But today, without power, they open their doors and ask the community for help. Luckily, our team is very well versed in dealing with emergencies this year, so we quickly jumped into action to make a plan. Um, we were scrambling a little bit, but luckily our community saw our Facebook post, came to us once again. We're so, so grateful. The community has brought several coolers, bags of ice, fans, and generators to help keep the animals cool while there is no air conditioning. The community blows us away. We, ha we did not expect to have exponentially much, much more than we anticipated. So we are, we're so lucky and we're so grateful that our community cares about our animals. As a former employee of KCHA, I'm very passionate about KCHA and when I knew they needed help, we decided to pick up pizzas, ice, and come up and donate our time and, and spend the day and up here and help them. Keeping fans blowing on ice in each room that house animals, full buckets of water to drink from in each kennel, and pools of water outside for dogs to play in are ways the staff, which most came in on their day off, kept the air cool. I'm here on my day off. We have many people who are here on their days off just to be able to help out because we all care. In Kanawha County, Addie Smith, WSAZ News Channel 3. Now, the Kanawha Charleston Humane Association was told the power would be back on at 11 o'clock tonight, but good news here, it came on earlier around noon today.